Hello everybody, welcome back to cooking with Brenda and David. Oh, my glasses are terrible. Well, maybe I can get by. I cleaned a little spot off of them. <laughs> Probably end up scratching them. We gotta go get our glasses, David. Okay, I'm gonna make pineapple dream dessert. Oh, it's so good. It's really good when it's hot outside because it's a cool dessert. Gosh, it's so good. So let's get going. The first Pineapple one, dream dessert. Dessert. I don't ever remember seeing that before. <laughs> David, you know what? Over the years, you mostly have a meat and desserts anyway, so okay. that's probably why you have to mostly eat too many. You eat ice cream sandwiches and stuff like that, but Pineapple not dream much dessert. Nothing. Pineapple dream dessert, dear. Dear. Okay. I have. Two and a half cups of graham cracker crumbs. And I am going to take out two of them. One. You crush them up however you can. I use a rolling pin normally. Well, you, I, I, that's what you was doing when I came home from work. You yeah, and let me tell you, it takes two. It takes two of these to make two and a half cups. But you had them in a plastic bag and you were smushing them? And smush I was them. smushing them with a the rolling pin. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> and I got a whole stick of butter, which is a half a cup. Now, it calls for a half a teaspoon of salt, but let me just tell you. I didn't have no unsalted butter, so I've got salted, so I'm not going to use any salt, okay? Salted what, butter. I didn't know they made salted. butter with salted you butter. You can control your butter a whole lot more if you use unsalted. Now we got to get these mixed in there real good. Supposed to have some sugar too. Fourth of a cup. Some of them uses it and some don't, but that's what my recipe calls for. It seems like an awful lot, but that's what the recipe calls for. Probably will be too sweet. Not too sweet for me because I love the sugar, but I bet it is, though. No, it isn't too sweet. Don't seem like. Is that the way you've done it before? Mm-hmm. I just didn't remember. I'm thinking a fourth of a cup, that seems like a lot, but some other things you make, it usually calls for a third or a fourth of a cup. This is more... Graham crackers than normal. That looks like too many for that dish. Did I use this dish or another dish, David? I don't know. Okay, get them all moistened. Mm -hmm. Get them all moistened. Preheat your oven to 300. That's an awful lot of that. Did I use an 8 by 10? I don't think so. And this is what I used. It's just a thick, it's just thick. You know what, if you've got a measuring cup, if you've got a metal one, it go, it does so good with this. Just mash it down real good. <clears throat> well, you need to even it all out real good first and then press it down. That looks even out to me, it's not hard to do. You gotta press it down real firm. I can't give it but so much myself. <laughs> you mean do it? I'll do it. My hands ain't too bad. I'm done working on that old truck. Are they greasy? Oh, the other day he had so much grease in his on his hands, but I can <clears> tell you it was just stained on there or something. But he usually does real good with his hands without having a lot of grease on them. I hope I can, I hope it'll well, pack enough. You got me that little scrub brush, and I use it in the shower. Yeah. That kind of helps it a little I've bit. I've got a bigger one if you want to use it. It's, <clears throat> it's a little bit bigger. Right there. I used it for something, but it wasn't hands or anything. I don't want to press in there together. Maybe it will when I put it in the oven. My oven was already on. I think so you had a bigger dish last time. I think so, too. I hope this is going to be right. It'll be good either way. But i got to make the rest of my stuff fit in here. Hmm. Look how thick that is. 
it'd be all right. Now, I don't remember if it was this one or a longer one. I think it was an eight by eight or a nine by nine. Anyhow, I'm gonna put that in there. Oh no, look at all that. I don't need that much in there. <laughs> That's against the rules to leave that kind in there. It was a lot. So how many graham crackers did you mash up in the bag? I told you. I just told you. Didn't you hear me? Uh -uh. Two of these. Two of them packs. The others. There's nine sheets in there, and there's four in each sheet. You might be able to get bigger ones. I don't know. So anyway... <coughs> David, let me get this going before you start your questions, okay? Mm -hmm. I'm going to bake this for only about 10 minutes, that's all. Some people do and some don't, and I think it does good like this. So that's all you're going to so do? So it's an old motion old bake. <laughs> so you're going to throw it in there for 10 minutes? Yeah, old motion old bake. Okay. Where's my clock? Where's my phone? Let me see, what time is it? All right, you just going to come back? Yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, I took it. I went ahead, I weighed it, and I took it out and let it cool because it's got to cool for until it gets cool. You know, you can't put your mixture in there and it's hot or just melt. So, most recipes don't call for this, I don't think, but I'm going to use it at least a half a teaspoon of vanilla. I like me some vanilla. And I'm going to put it right in there with some butter. I got a half a stick, I mean I got a stick of butter, which is another half a cup. So all in all, you got two sticks of butter. Hmm. And I'm going to cream these together right over here. Let me plug it up. How come you ain't using one of your fancy mixers? Because I, want, I need to use this this time. I do I need to use this one this time. It's easier to, I don't want all my butter and, and that all over the place, okay? <laughs> See what I gotta do in a minute, ain't gonna be easy either. Come on, baby, come on. Look, it's all right in there. Hmm. <coughs> Look. Sadie would kind of like to lick the beaters on something like butter <laughs> like that, wouldn't she? I do too. It's good. She would love it, though. Yeah. Let's go ahead and put some. Of, I've got two cups of confectionery sugar, so I'm going to do a little bit at a time, okay? Huh. More sugar? Confectionery sugar in this, David. Huh. Let it go. All right. We're going to make this dessert. Let her go. Don't get me confused. It's a lot to it. We've really been sick. I've been sick, lost my boys. I have a sinus infections when I thought are probably allergies to this time of year. Everything's blooming so beautiful, I love it. <laughs> Spring is here, I'm happy. It was I'm, snowing last weekend. I'm ready to plant some bulbs if I can. <laughs> we'll try anyway. You know what, David? That pour That's going to really be hard to get the rest of that in there. That but it's got to go. Act like yeah. it ain't got no power hardly. I know, I smell it. I know. Well, let me see if I can just think. You smell, that's a mixer for you, okay? But you don't want to let it be under a bind for too long. You need to fix that. That's not going to work. You have to, you have well, you, to fix it. You can't bog it down all at one time. You have to do a little at a little bit. This is so thick. What do you want me to do? You want me to do it? Um, <clears throat> no, I'm just saying it's thick, David. I'm trying to work with it. It here. looks like plaster. Let me show you how to do it. I know how to mix plaster. No. See, let me tell you something. There's going to be some <clears throat> pineapple to go in here. Just a little bit. I don't think it's going to work. 
Well, let me do this for a minute and see if I can get it incorporated like this. You're going to have to break out one of them big old big You know mamas. what I'm going to do? Here's what I'm going to do. I just feel, I just put it back in here. I might, I might put some more of this in there. I don't usually, but... More butter? That's not butter. Oh. Know what you're talking about before you start. What Cream is cheese. It? Oh. That looks like butter. I thought butter was yellow. Some butter ain't. Well, you know I'm colorblind. Some butter, not yellow. <clears throat> this will give it a little more moisture. Let's see if we can work it like that. Maybe not, but if I can get that mixed in there. You can do it? No. You remember we'll get that big drill and that plaster mixer I got? Might have to ways it's looking. Make sure the cord don't start smoking. I hope not. <laughs> I hope not too. See, I'm going to put some... You're going to have to break out the other one. Come on, get off. Damn it. What is it being so hateful for? I, don't know. I bet I know why, because normally I would use blue bonnet, and I'm using real butter. That sure is setting up. I'm getting it. It's getting incorporated. Just give it a minute. So you're supposed to use a different kind of butter? Margarine no, or something? Usually I use margarine. Butter is butter's really thick. And even when it's at room temperature, it doesn't seem like it's real, real soft. Like margarine or something does. I guess margarine probably got water in. I don't know what I was in it. But I got to do something different here. Why well, you have to use a stick and just stare at that way or something? <laughs> okay, David, I'll be right back, okay? All right. Okay, I'm going to put a heaping tablespoon, okay? You're going to tell them who helped you whip it up? David did. He burnt the mixer up, I believe. I smell it real bad. I'll think about it. Yeah, I'll unplug that thing because that thing is hot. And look here, that'll set up like that. No. Oh. Now I'm just going to mix this in here, okay? Pineapple. You should have just used the, the one of your, these other mixers you got. Well, I usually do use the stand one, David, but I've always used that for this. Well, you never had this one too, too long ago. How'd you do it in the old days? I've always used one of these. Oh. Well, that thing's... We've always had one of those. Right? That one mom used to have it look like a spaceship. I don't know where it's at. It's probably Good, up, we are probably. It's probably up there on top of the shelf here somewhere or something. Oh, just a little bit more of that in there. It's supposed to be a tablespoon. Let's put two. Some Which that ain't a tablespoon. It's just a teaspoon. A spoon really. of it went in the floor. Hmm? Don't slip on it. I've never even seen that, David. This just seems like it's going to be too much, but it is going to be too much. I still got that thing of Cool Whip to go. Well, what'd you do wrong? Okay, let's put this on here. I don't know. I don't know what I did wrong. Well, some of that stuff you haven't done in a long time. You already just not do a trial run. Maybe we'd call this a blooper trial or something. Yeah, last time you done that was one in family. I honestly think it was a bigger pan. But I think it was too, because it was one in family reunions. What I'm going to do is, Wasn't it? I'm going to just use half of it. Well, not some of that stuff you took to one of the family reunions or I something? I think so. Because I remember it was a bigger thing. I know what I wish we had other than that tonight. What? Some of those little weeny things from the pressure cooker thing or something. The little weeny thing. Yeah, remember everybody brings them things to the reunions? Yeah. What do you call them things? Little smokies. Yeah. Little barbecued little yeah. smokies. That's what we need right now. They're good. We don't you need know, no you pie. You know that has grape jelly in them? And mustard too, I believe. They ain't got my mouth watering now. <laughs> Does it sound like it's got all that in it? What no, I'll do it is I'll do some more graham crackers tomorrow and use the rest of that, okay? Mm-hmm. Come on, this ain't doing too good. It wants to stick to it. Just 
supposed to try to even it up and make it pretty. <coughs> look at all that. Maybe you need a better thing here. Something that'll make like one of these ones with the rubber thing on it or something. That probably worked, Dave. Let me try that one. You want this one right here? I got something I usually use, you know. I don't know. There's another one right here. There's a, a blue one. I pulled this one out, though. I just took it out. <clears throat> you did? Yeah. I pulled one of them out of thought. I got all kinds of things to use, Dave. You're tripping off a bunch here lately. No, I'm not. <laughs> what would I be tripping on? I don't know. you taking your medication right? Golly. I'm going to put a knot on your head. I don't, be... I don't have any medication for men or nothing like that, okay? I know, but I I'm don't. just... I don't. Maybe you need some. I don't. <clears throat> I don't. Or I could use some. Definitely. <laughs> You're the one that can use some for sure. <clears throat> Ooh, you gonna use all that? Ooh, <laughs> you're so funny, David. Ooh, well, what I don't use, I'll put back in here and save for tomorrow. Okay, I'll make another one of these. Maybe I can make it. I can always cook better when he's not in the kitchen. You know, always. If you always notice, I never have like sweets and stuff. Look at here. All that too, David. Am I going to use all that? Yeah, I'm going to use all that. And I got more graham cracker crumbs too. You just ruined that yeah. pineapple. Huh? Just ruined that pineapple. How did I do that? <laughs> <laughs> now I got to mix all this up real good. I'm just mess with He's full of it tonight. I'm going to tell you, he's definitely full of it tonight. I don't know what I'm going to do with him, but he's full of it. You know, I have so just a little half a hand of coconut in here. It's real good with it. I didn't get it out, so I'm not gonna go back out and get it. But coconut powder or something or coconut co powder. I mean that stuff. <laughs> I'm not gonna say that don't exist because I'm sure it does. But no, I mean it's like those flakes coconut. or something. Mm -hmm. a, fl a coconut flake, coconut. Most of Everybody but David knows exactly what that means. I sure would like to see one of them trees that grow coconuts. I mean, I've seen them on the TV set and everything, but I sure like to see them in real life one of these days before I kick the bucket. It'd be nice. Maybe someday we'll go to Florida. I've seen and, the orange trees, but... I ain't never seen them either. I have. Yeah, we did once. No, I ain't never seen one. We went to Florida? I ain't never been to no Florida. <laughs> I now told you. Add this layer. Well, it's fried or something. I don't know what's wrong. How would I see it if you didn't? Probably on gun smoke or something. Down there. I don't know. <laughs> the medication, you're going to have to adjust that stuff a little bit, woman. <laughs> My graces. Now, I wonder why it didn't take all that, but it's going to take all this. You asking well, me? Yeah, I'll be. We ain't never been to no Florida. <laughs> I guess it was on the TV that <clears> I seen it. Are you get joking around or are you serious? And your sister lived in Georgia for how long? I never been down there. You never went to Georgia? We no. never did? No. Well she's moved around all over the place. She lived in California and I bet you she's seen more than pineapple fruit. Far as south I ever been is North Carolina and far as north I ever been is uh, when I went and picked up my sister from the Christian College in Ohio. I picked her up right on the West Virginia line. Which one? Dana. She went to the Christian College? Yeah, she went to the Christian College up there. Oh. Back in 1985. It was a long time ago. I think it was 85. might have been 82. Now, I've got to let this chill for a couple hours, so we'll have to come back in just a little bit and show you what it turned out like, Okay. Got to chill, everything's got to chill together. But wait just a minute, we're not done yet. Maybe you put some candles on it. Candles? <coughs> Whose birthday is it? No, no, we're just pretend like it's somebody's. What is that? Oh, it's more than graham crackers. <laughs> Who's, who, who needs to adjust their medicine? <coughs> I'm going to tell you, I'm going to put him on something. He's about to drive me crazy. He's wanting to retire, and I done told him, no, he is not retired, or I'll have to find somewhere to go in the daytime. No. You got to stay down at your garage all the time or something. Don't come up here in this house. You'll get in trouble for sure. You will. 
<clears throat> I'm getting old and demented. So you got like a crust on the bottom and a crust on the top, only this one is loose. That one's packed together. Hopefully it'll be all right. <coughs> It seems like everything I've turned to touch lately turned to mush, so we'll see. It's supposed to be enough of this to. I hope it'll hold on. I'm not gonna put it all. Okay, folks, we'll be back in a little bit and let's see how it turns out. Okay, I'm gonna clean it up, pretty it up some. Okay, and I'll show you when we get back. Do you have to bake it or anything? I'm gonna go or? find David some mental meds. He needs them. Well, you know okay. that show one flew over to cuckoo nest. That's him for sure. <laughs> Ain't it, David? He's about as nutty as they come at times. He so you got, something. I'm afraid to let him drive. He might not remember his way back home. You? You? Well, I do get lost sometimes. I, I really have blind moments. <laughs> let me tell you, I do. Do you have to bake it now or something? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Just got to let it chill. Look at that, how pretty it goes <clears> in my hand. Uh-uh-uh, that's good. Oh, do you I've put... had thrust two times because of my medicine. And sinuses in between or allergies or whatever and I lost my voice and I got the thrust now but it's looking better but it's still big old red splotches up in there and it is so sore. What are they gonna do about it? Well I don't know rheumatology usually takes care of it. B told me to go to my family doctor and I usually take folic acid. I figure they just need to raise those some up some I don't know but if they don't do something I'll quit taking that medicine. This is terrible. You can't hardly <clears throat> even eat nothing soft. That's going to go down pretty good, though, don't you think? I hope it'll turn out right. It looks like it is. Right. As long as it'll all hold together and I can get it out of this bowl and make it look pretty, that's what we're after. So you got to put it in the refrigerator or something? Yes, or? I'm going to put it. I'm going to clean it up a little bit, though. Okay. See the mess? All righty. All right, we'll be back in just a little bit. Okay, look, this needs to stay in the refrigerator at least two hours. Overnight's good, but I don't have overnight to wait. Well, how long have you had it in there? It's been in there a couple of hours, two hours at least. It doesn't seem like it's been that long. It don't, does it? Let me see if I can get it out where it looks pretty. Well, <clears throat> it fell apart just a little bit, but that's okay. The first piece is always hard to get out. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. Mighty crumbly, though. You ready to taste it? Mm -hmm. David never has been one to eat a whole bunch of desserts and stuff like that, though. So that's me. <laughs> well, would you like to get this bite yourself? or? I know she can hear me better if you're hearing it in. No, no, that's too bad. I was listening to a video there. What kind of video? Monkeys. Monkeys. I like watching monkeys. I watch all kinds of things. Eat this stuff. Fill your pie hole and hush it for one time. Hmm. Mmm. <laughs> that is better than I thought. I have that, had that before. I remember now. Yeah. Well, good. I'm glad you remembered. Yeah. It that is, is good. good. I love stuff like that, though. Seriously, I didn't think it'd be good, but I'll it is. I'll share that with Becky and Jackie tomorrow. Cause, yeah. Uh -uh, we'll be eating every bit of that. Yeah, I've had that before. It is good. I still think that's too many crumbs on the bottom, but you don't have to make it that thick, but usually it is pretty thick. And you bake it a little bit in the oven helps it to form together better. Okay, y'all. I want to thank all of you for watching our videos. I hope everybody's staying safe out there. What's next? I don't know yet, but I'll come up with something. <laughs> I've got several things planned for the next couple of uh, videos, so I don't know. I'm not going to do nothing cabbage, I don't think. He's wanting me to make kraut, but I don't know if I'm going to tackle that or not. I guess I will. He wants me to. Well, we got them old timey crock pots, and they haven't been used in decades. Maybe so. we'll use with the little one and not the big one. Yeah, that's big one's huge, and I'm like, oh, yeah. I don't want to cut up that much cabbage. Yeah, we'll do a little one. But And I'm not doing the dishes tonight either. I just don't, I'm not up to par 100% yet. So, my mouth is still really sore. I guess I got to go to the doctor again. I'm sick of going to the doctor. Anyway, we've had a rough little bit being sick and everything, and I'm so sorry that we're late on our video. Well, we've been sick more this year than we ever have I been. I know. I've left a couple messages. Right. I have a funny feeling a lot of mine's allergies plus this thrush in my mouth. I don't know what I've got, so but I mean, bad. I feel a little bit better today, but 
<clears throat> my friend asked me, you want week. some of this fresh pineapple? And I'm like, oh no, 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 no. But <clears throat> thank you because my mouth's already sore like that. And, uh, you gonna eat some of that? Yeah, I'm gonna eat some of it. You wanna try a piece? Mm -mm. You gonna eat yours? Yeah. Well, I'll get me a piece and just do Go it. ahead and try a piece. Now, there was something else I wanted to tell me that made me forget because you interrupted me. As usual. Well, that's what I'm here for. <laughs> That's what you're here for to interrupt me. You done pretty good at that. So, well, anyway, y'all, I hope we'll see you sooner than later this time. I hope and pray. So, I uh, just want to get better. We got so many pretty blooms down here, and I love them. Springs on the way. I got daffodils all the way around the house. Well, one side's starting to die down whenever the other side. Well, it snowed last week, so that's kind of weird. It don't hurt them, though, not yeah. daffodils. Okay. Okay, y'all, we'll see you soon. Take care and God bless you. Bye.